welcome and congratulations for accepting this 14 day meditation challenge for the next 14 days we're going to learn to meditate with Sri Sri Yoga teachers and Soham Yoga teachers meditation is a time-tested ancient practice which works at the physical the emotional and intellectual and spiritual level at the physical level all the stress hormones the cortisols the adrenaline they are optimized they are minimized and the happy hormones the dopamine the oxytocin the endorphins they, they increase and they have party inside at the mental level the thought patterns they calm down you get clarity about decision making about what to do in life and our emotions stabilize our intellect becomes more sharper and there is a sense of oneness and well-being with everyone it's easier to meditate in the beginning with guidance and the way our teachers will guide you the meditation would become so much effortless and easy great how to meditate it's tricky isn't it there are rules for meditation some do's and don'ts now what do you need to do first and foremost how should one sit you can sit in sukhasan the easy pose in cross leg position or you can sit in padmasan if you can <laughs> or you can sit in chair asana you can sit very comfortably and easily on a chair make sure that your back is fully rested you can use a wall to support especially your low back Try, try to ensure there's no gap between the lower back and the chair or the wall. Then, we sit with our back and our head erect as much possible. Shoulders taken back and down so that they are open and not hunched back. Open up your shoulder and the palms can be on the lap, open to the, towards the ceiling. You can have your hands in the way the teacher guides or simply in Jnana Mudra with your index finger touching the thumb to increase your focus and placing it towards the ceiling. Make sure the body is softened, loose and relaxed so that you're not holding on to any tightness anywhere. But during meditation, you may feel sometimes your head is dropping forward if that is um, happening on its own so whenever you become aware you can gently straighten and let go release hmm. how not to meditate meditation is not concentration you might have read a lot of books or heard some speakers talking about this you need to focus at a, at a single object or um, focus at a candle without blinking. No. Meditation is deconcentration. You totally relax and let go. Of course, the effect of meditation is concentration. But the process itself is that of letting go. So if the instruction is think of an apple, you know what it means. You just get an idea of what an apple is. But if you start analyzing, is the apple red or green or is it big or is it small? Has it come from Spain or from California? Then that is effort. And when there is effort, you cannot relax. Your mind wanders here and there meditation becomes difficult so being totally effortless as the words comes from the instructors you don't have to listen intently just listen gently as if there is some music going on the words just fall onto your ears and you relax more and more 
So, welcome aboard the 14 days meditation challenge. See you on the day one.